We're in White Springs. Uh, on that Atlas Obscura website that we found, they, uh, they had this as one of the destinations and it's right here by another Florida State Park, but the White Sulphur Springs in White Springs. I was like the worst light ever. My hair I looks know. like cotton. <laughs> um, <laughs> evidently, it was a fountain of health. I'm standing in front of a sign it's, that actually says yeah. fountain of health. And um, it was like one of the original tourist destinations for uh, Florida. Florida back in like the 1830s. I think they found it. And it was like a place where people would come and get healthy they had this big huge hotel around the it and to like, yeah the sulf it was like a cure-all sulfuric sulfuric i don't know waters Mystical. were um uh yeah everyone people thought evidently it was healing so anyhow so Everybody we're here right now i want to turn this around but i want to get out of this light because it's like Blinding. well a and not only that it's gonna we're gonna get fried today if we yeah. don't all right i'm gonna turn this around so you can see the sign and the staircase that goes down where we're heading All right, how cool is this? In those old, old, old photos of this place, people would stand around here and it was like, I guess on the other side of this wall is a pool. I'm not sure, we haven't been there yet. It looks like we're staying in the pool because of the blue. Hold on. All right, so well, <laughs> it's not exactly the kind of place that you'd probably want to swim these days. I'm sure back in the uh, 1830s. It was probably nice, and we have heard that the the water has, has dried up. Um, not like uh, the, the water from the river will come right. in here, I think now. But the the like healing sulfuric water or whatever, it's it's no more. Like that dried up a, like in the early 1900s, I think. Oh no, in 1990, but like in the early 1900s, they I don't know. But anyhow, like the water's not there anymore. We the don't Swanee know. The Swanee River overflows into it now, and that makes what we got here today. I don't know. I'm going to turn this around so you can see this. It's not nice. I mean, it's cool. I'm glad we're here, but it's not nice. Okay. So this is what we're looking at. We need to go to the other side of that wall over there and look at the river. All right, so I don't know what else is over here. There's a little bridge right here that um, it goes, I think it goes over to the Stephen Foster State Park, which we've never been to. So we may go check that out too while we're here. Uh, yeah, what do you think? Should we go that way? Yep, let's just walk. So we just left White Springs, White Sulphur Springs in White Springs, Florida, Florida, yeah. and it's about an hour and a half. Or no, 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 no not it's no, not long. It's, it's a like long. three hours. <laughs> Hold on, it's like what? Uh, it's, seriously, it was 176 it miles. It feels like three home. hours. No, um, all right, it was an hour and a half from Tallahassee. But all right, so it turns out the White Sulphur Spring was discovered, at, I think, around the 1930s, no. and it was uh, like 1830s. 1830. 1830. Whatever. You know what I meant. You're 100 years old. I know. And uh, evidently, the, like, they thought the waters were healing, the sulfuric waters, and they thought it was healing. And even, like, the Native American tribes that were, like, rival tribes in the, in the area would put 
like all of their differences aside so they could all bathe in these waters and kind of like drink from these waters and like get all their healing properties. But it became this big like health resort yeah. and spa area and for about a hundred years it was like a pretty big deal. And then like I think that the sulfuric waters dried up in the 90s, it 1990s. Was, it was 1990. Yeah, it's, but anyhow, but there's one layer of this gazebo that's left looking down onto a pool that bleeds over into the Swanee River. And it's kind of like, I don't know, it's nothing that it looks like well, anything you'd want to swim in. Although people were canoeing and kayaking by. The rivers, I would want to swim the in. rivers are really high. Yeah. And so it's kind of spilt in. I would like to see it when it doesn't, it's not full of the Swanee River itself. Yeah. You know? We saw a park ranger who said that just like last week when we were, okay, well, we were at the Swanee, I don't know when, but, uh, and not only that, none of this ever makes sense because we were there recently. Uh, cause we never know when we're going to post this We were the Swanee River. Uh, no, we were at the Swanee River recently we and the water the level was so we high the river that, well, what, what, what did I say wrong? You said we were at the river. We were at the river, Swanee River. You can say Swanee, you can be to any river in the world. We were at the Swanee River recently and the water was so high it washed out the trails and we couldn't even enjoy the park and, uh, which is, and again, mean, it's it fine, it's like a blanket. Like only water. wash out the trails, I mean. The trails are the a lot water. Of, yeah, everything was underwater. Yeah. Okay, so, um, but the, the park ranger that we talked to today said that the, um, the water, okay, there's a concrete, uh, it's the pool barrier that, um, anyhow, you'll see from the photos, but it, it's pretty high from the ground level. It's, it's really like high. 10 foot tall. Oh, yeah. And uh, the water from the river was so high, it was up the side of that. And, and it spoke uh, into the pool itself. Yeah, but there was, but there's, it's kind of stagnant and muck a little bit. And just like gross yeah. everywhere uh, from that. But anyhow, but it was really cool to see. And it's got beautiful views, like really beautiful views of the Swanee River. river. And, um, and White Springs is a cool little town. Like there's a little general it's store great, we walked it's a great, around. It's a great and, um, yeah, there's like Lots neat of old stuff. Houses and, and, yeah. There's also Stephen Foster um, Folk something state park that's right there too, which is another one of the Florida state parks. And there's a really cool tower, the Carillon Tower there. There's a lot of stuff at the grounds. They've got canoe launches. They've got some pretty cool stuff there. Um, and uh, anyhow, so we, yeah, we just kind of it was worth the, the trip. Area. Yeah, you know, we're like, we're so easy to please. We kind of always look at it like this. Even when we've gone to places and you get there and it's nothing more than just a monument and that's it. It's kind of like still got us out of the house for the day. Yeah. So like we're kind of good either way. Uh, but today was definitely worth the trip. And I so think it's kind of neat. It. Like when we traveled and it's like we'll go. We pass all these little towns and stuff, but you never oh, really yeah. realize kind of what's yes. in it. Like going and, off the beaten path right. to get to these places. Yeah. Like very cool. And, you know, this is another one of those places that we found on Atlas Obscura. And I say that it sounds like we're doing a plug for them, which we're, we're not. totally not. We I don't have really I, we have no connection to this app. Kind of but, stuff yeah. that you just don't think about. But and it we also love gives discovery you, kind of really unusual things. It also gets you in these little towns, too. And so, then, yeah. You know, it's kind of fun. So, very we, cool. we've been to like that. We have been to White Springs before. We have, yeah. But yeah, never on the way to like, another state park. So, but this gave yeah. us a chance to kind of explore more. Um, and kind of get out and see things that we saw the first time we were there, but we didn't even know what it was, and now we've actually discovered it. So, yeah. here we go. All right, so that's it. Uh, we're gonna wrap this up, and uh, we're on our way actually to another place on Atlas Obscura, but I don't wanna talk about it now, because we'll talk about it in another video or something later. Uh, anyhow, thanks for watching, yeah. and have a great day. Hit stop.